how to convert data or text already in a Word document into a table to make it look more presentable, today we'll show you two ways to do so. Let's say you had certain data in your Word document already, like the one shown here, but you want to make it look table mode. This apparently might look table mode divided, but it really is not. Some columns are not even aligned properly. In fact, there's a way to see exactly how many spaces or indentations there are in a text, and the show hide button is the one that tells us that. We find it in the home menu, and you just have to click on it. The show hide feature shows paragraph marks and other hidden formatting symbols. This is especially useful for advanced layout tasks. So let's try the first way to put the data in a table. Select the text and up in the insert menu click on table and convert text to table. Here we can choose how we want our table to be, the number of columns, where we want to separate the text at, we'll leave it at paragraphs. Click OK and now our data is inside a table, but in single columns. To divide it into rows we can use the draw table option inside the insert and table menu. This feature allows you to design your own table by drawing the cell, row, and column borders yourself. We click on it and start drawing the rows. But now as you can see, the third row looks a little bit funny, since the data wasn't really aligned to make it fit in the cell. So that's where the second way to convert text to table becomes so useful and precise. Please take a few seconds to subscribe to our channel and leave a comment below. Let's press Ctrl Z to undo and start from the beginning. We'll click the Show Hide button once again, and we'll place our cursor at the end of the word month. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus the right arrow to automatically select the spaces there, represented by the little dots you see. Once selected, press the Tab key. What this means is that we're telling Word where to divide the words into cells. Once we tab, a little tab arrow will show instead. So this is how it will look once we apply it to all the data. We'll now select the text and under the Insert and Table menu, we'll click Convert Text to Table. If you notice, now the Separate At area automatically sets itself in the Tabs option. We'll click OK. And now a nice and aligned table has been created for us. We'll get rid of the paragraph marks by clicking the Show Hide button under the Home menu again. Now you know a few options to get your data nicely organized using Microsoft Word tables. <music>